TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down 266. You get the NASDAQ off 136. S&Ps are down 36. That uh, puts the NASDAQ down 1.7%. Dow down 1%. S&Ps down 1.3%. Gold contract. Gold contract uh, trading up $4.70 at 1312 an ounce. We have silver down two cents, $15.41 an ounce. Notes and bonds, bottom line, higher price, lower yield. Go take a look at that 10 year right now. 10 years up 21 ticks, trading 124.01. And the 10 year yield right now, folks, is 2.453. That's the low for the last 12 months. Now, they both broke a B point. They have volume on the break. That's saying that the 10 year is going to go back to 2.1. Yes, 2.1%. We're going to take a look at the 30 year. Same setup in the 30. 30 year. They've been building cars to get up and over this uh, January 3rd price area. That area is 147.31 inside the, the 30. Bottom line, blew that away today. You're at 148.17. And they both are very large ABC structures on the way up. What had happened, folks, from January all the way over uh, to this morning is that you had a consolidation. It was a high-end consolidation. It refused to back off. Bottom line, rates are going down. King dollar. What do you have with King dollar? The battle's still out there between the bulls and bears and King dollar. Won't give it up. Uh, now, we have out here today. That being said, the bottom line is that what you had is this. On Wednesday, Fed uh, comes I mean, third, yeah, Wednesday, uh, Fed comes out. Bottom line, dovish statement. Dollar goes downtown with volume, 25,000 contracts. Yesterday goes right back topside with 28,000 contracts. Uh, we have out here today, you only got 20,000. Uh, it should have actually been able to get to the high of 96 at 685 today. We got to 90, uh, yeah, we got to 96 to 290. So we'll see where this shakes out. I suspect uh, what, this is, what this is all about, there's no doubt, this is about where the pound is trading. And the pound out here today is at 132, as well as the euro. And the, the pound and the euro uh, is, are going to be in play uh, for quite some time here. The euro took a hit out here today, down 79 ticks. That's why you see that dollar index up. Uh, this is going after the lower end of its consolidation once again. Market-wise, bottom line, folks, is that you're going to have volume out here today. You're going to have lower prices out here today. Uh, if you take a look at the SPY, what you're going to see on a weekly basis, you're going to have a failure in price, failure in volume uh, from the high to 81.87 is the number to keep your eye on. We got over it. You're going to close under it on the weekly. Get price, get volume. Market wants to go south. Dow is down 260. NASDAQ off 135. S&P's off 37. Come right back.